Well, folks, apparently you like to see me do like incredibly dumb things with technology. So my team decided it was time for me to try to step into virtual reality. Try VR. So we tried a few different games. We tried one where I was like using a conductor's baton to slash at phantom boxes. Okay, I still don't understand this game. And then also we tried sensory deprivation in, in some weird way. Okay, well, bye. It was very strange. And then finally, we settled on the most important game of all. And we settled on this game because my wife, like Joe Biden's, is in fact a doctor. And so I figured that by the process of osmosis, I must have, you know, somehow become a better doctor. And so we tried that out through a game involving surgery. And it went, well, you'll see. Ah, terrible writing job, doctor. Oh, now I've got a spoon and a pen. Ah, that's not useful. Hello. Okay, it's like patient name, Bob. Heart transplant. Okay then. Oh, good Lord. Okay, this seems not great. He does have a pulse. Not for long, my friends. Okay, let's see. What am I supposed to do with this guy? Oh, okay. Okay, fine, let's do this shit. Here we go. I don't need to sanitize. Oh no. No, 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 no. Oh no, what is he? Oh my god, did you just cut a rib like that? <laughs> <laughs> Ooh. Probably shouldn't have let it go like that, but you know. Good thing I have no feet, otherwise that would be bad. Okay, turn off. Stop. Turn it off. Okay, whatever. Okay, Bob. I'm afraid you're in trouble here. I got in through an affirmative action program. I'm a very diverse doctor. May not be good, but I'm diverse. Okay. Bone saw. Okay, what am I gonna do here? There should be a tool that helps me, like, spread open his chest cavity. You forgot the medicine. Oh. Should I have given him some anesthetic? Ah, yeah, maybe. Right in the neck. Okay, well, glad he's out now. Before he seemed pretty dead, now he still seems pretty dead, so. It's like Cuban medical care right here. You know what'd be amazing is if you could actually grip. Whoa, what is happening right now? Whoa, the world has become incredibly blurry. This seems not good, all right, fine. F it, long. Long. He doesn't need any edge. He's still alive, doesn't need lungs. I'm finding out new things about medicine. Okay, open. Yeah, pour that out on the table. Okay, I'm gonna stuff that shit in there. Okay. Poonk. Yeah, that, that, that's like, it's so far so good. Okay, where's the other lung go? Uh, I tossed it somewhere. Anybody seen a lung? Eh, you know. He only needs one lung, probably. Uh. Huh? I'm just hitting with a hammer now. Uh, well, I feel like that lung would have been useful at this point. Anybody seen one? Let's see. Uh, it disappeared. I threw his lung and now his lung's gone. Shouldn't I have a surgical assistant of some sort? Wake up! I shouldn't wake him up. Oh, it's down here. That seems sanitary. Oh, but it's, oh no. Hello. Ah, uh, all right. Has anybody actually seen the lung? The lung's like down here. Ah, oh, it's gone. Oh, it went all the way over here. Okay, well, I guess I, I can't actually reach his lung now. <laughs> that seems not ideal. Well, I just have like a lung. It's just a human lung out here. I can't reach it because the space that you are allotted is beyond me. So he's dead now. <laughs> yeah, who needs that? <laughs> I literally cannot get to his lung. That's a, that seems bad. We're just gonna see. Brutal murder achieved. Well, they can't all be winners, guys. You know, he had a heart problem. Well, folks, you know, this is very disorienting, but I'll tell you what's not disorienting. Excellent skincare. 
people are raving about GenuCell skincare. Here is a review from GenuCell.com from Claire. Quote, I absolutely love GenuCell. My skin feels so good. Tighter, younger, with a more even tone. I only used it for a week. My advice for everyone, take a before picture. It's not just for women. It's not just Claire. GenuCell has sold over 1 million products to both women and men across the nation. Luckily for you, for the first time ever, GenuCell is including both the Ultra Retinol and Dark Spot Corrector in their most popular package at GenuCell.com slash Ben. GenuCell's Ultra Retinol contains a powerful retinol alternative that is safe for your skin. Their Dark Spot Corrector will help reduce sunspots. Plus, you'll still get GenuCell's world-class under-eye bags therapy to help alleviate puffiness. GenuCell promises immediate effects. You'll see results in 12 hours guaranteed or your money back. My producer, Savvy, just had a baby. She hasn't been sleeping much, but using GenuCell under-eye treatment has helped her get rid of those bags under her eyes. Don't wait. Visit GenuCell.com slash Ben. Save over 70% off their most popular package. Every order subscription includes a luxury gift box with two free springtime essentials just in time for warmer weather and free shipping. So head on over to GenuCell.com slash Ben. That's G-E-N-U-C-E-L dot com slash Ben. Okay, well, this is pretty brutal. I mean, maybe I'll do better this time. What do I do with this thing? I, I do have a hang for this now that's a little better. Like I sawed this asshole open. It gets a little messy. And uh, I need to replace his heart, right? So open that up. Cool. I don't think he actually... Oh, you uh, gotta get the other one out. I'll just leave that there for the moment. That's not gonna go anywhere, probably. Yeah, that's fine. Okay, put it. No, no. You don't run away. You stay. We'll put you on a clock. Why not? Seems good. And now, ah, I see. Here is the heart. Am I supposed to just like completely remove his? Uh... I feel like he's gonna need that after. No, it's his liver. Put it back. Oh, uh, maybe these. I, I can't get to his actual heart in there. I can't grab his, like, ribs and pull him out. So, all right. The dude doesn't need a chest cavity. F it. This seems like this is, a, this is a very bad surgery center. Obamacare happening. Oh, okay. Scalpel is... This is okay, fine. Here we go. Whoop. And we're gonna go... Whoop. That's bad. Whoop. Oop, oop. Oh, okay, well, oh well. Didn't do much better the second time. Yeah, good job, I think. Right. <laughs> you really are like sad killing these people. Would your wife be proud? Uh, I'm gonna go no. She probably would not be proud, but at least it was on tape so that when I get sued for malpractice, we're, and it's very clear. Okay. Well, folks, I cannot recommend that I be your doctor for surgery. I don't think it's gonna go all that amazing. Well, the, the good news is that that guy who is now brain dead qualified to be president of the United States.